Hey guys, so today we have the Majoret Black Edition gift pack. It comes with five cards. And before we start, I have to tell you something, guys. <clears throat> I'm not trying to mean that just do unboxing videos, do Lego videos, Connects videos, Beyblade videos. We also have another channel it's called Positive Gaming. So let's start. So as you can see, the five cards start with the Audi R8 Coupe on, on this side. Audi R8 Coupe. Then we have the Nissan GTR Nismo GT3. Then we have the Brabus B63S. Then we have the Mercedes AMG GTR. And then we have the Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. So, let's open it. Get my trusty scissors. But first, let's just quickly show you the back as well. Okay. Let's open it up. Okay, there we go. Take out. Here we have the all the files like this. They're all nice coloured. Let me just quickly do it one by one, just take this out. Since now, this time I have some scissors, it's going to be a lot easier. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> right. There we go. Next one. Okay. First car. We have let's take the plastic off. We have the Audi R8 Coupe. For this car, nothing opens up. It's got a very stiff suspension. I really like this car. It's got a nice sleek matte black which I really like so next call back to the scissors. Okay. There we go. Next one is the Nissan GTR Nismo GT3. Okay, so here it is. Well, I really like this one. This might be my favorite one. This one has an easier suspension, and the doors actually open on this one if I do it quickly. There we go, the doors open. It's got something inside of it. Here it is. Here's the front. Can we close the doors? Here's the back. It's got a nice spoiler as well. Wait, wait. Does it? Okay, I thought the spoiler moved because it looked a bit loose. Oh, I think it does. Wait. Okay, never mind, it's just a bit loose. Okay, that's fine. Next car. When I when I got this, this this one was 
my favourite. Now, as it looks so far, it might be my second favourite. Because the Nissan is my favourite now. Now that I have it in person. I love how this is made for children, but the plastic that they use is childproof. I'm using scissors and, it, and it's still struggling. There we go. So we have the Brabus B63S, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, Brabus B63S, I was correct. Here we have it. So with this one, the Brabus, the... Wait, is it that? Is that it? Is it? It only comes up that much. Just that. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna keep it down because I don't want it to break. I'm just gonna keep it down. So here it is. It's got a nice suspension. It's also got a spare tire, as you can see on the back. Okay, anyways, nice car, it's got red rims, it's really nice, I like it. Now the, so guys don't worry if you didn't get to see them properly, I'm going to do them all again. This time I'm just going to open both of them, it's a lot easier to just... Okay. There we go. them all in deeper once I show you all of them quickly get them all show them one more time let's just take the plastic off of this one okay uh, okay so first we have the Mercedes AMG GTR oh this one might have the best suspension guys this is really smooth so here's the front, it's got some nice detail on the logo, it's a bit dusty, just came out the box, and the doors open, oh this is so much smoother than the other ones, as you can see, it's got a nice interior, as you can just kind of see from there, close the doors, oh this might be my, it's not my favourite, but it might be the easiest one to play with, that's the back. There we go. And the final one. Wait, the back tires. This one's not moving. Oh, there we go. Wait, what? This one's the back. Okay. Do a bit of suspension work. Okay, there we go. Might have to put some oil on this one, the back. As are a bit stiff. But this one. Okay, so this one also, the doors open, are so much easier, which all of them were like this, also a nice interior too. So if I just close it up, as you can see, it's got nice suspension, here's the front, here's the side of it, here's the back. I just realised that the windshields are blue, as you can see, look, the, the, the thing is blue. And now let's get all of them. So first came Alvaro Coupe, the Nissan, the Brabus, the Mercedes, and the Dodge. All right. So let's go into detail. First, Alvaro Coupe. As you can tell, it's got a nice light, the nice metallic matte black finish on the paint. A nice Audi logo, the grill as well. 
It's got a nice interior. You can kind of see it through the windshield, the clear windshield. And then it's also got some nice rims. <clears throat> and then we have the... You can kind of see the engine through the back wind, windshield. And then the it's got some nice back printing on the tail lights. And then... And then the doors, sadly, they don't open up, but it's got some nice printing as well. <clears throat> Alright, so next car. Uh, we have my personal favourite, the Nissan GTO. It's got nice ventilation on the top. It's got some nice detail, and then the... I forgot what this is called, but it's on the front bumper. And it's like a modification. And it's got some nice lights, the GTR sign, the Nissan sign. And then, as you can tell, it's got a nice red line across the whole car on the bottom. The rims are all blacked out and it's got a nice suspension as well. <clears throat> Again, the nice matte black finish. And you can just open the doors. And then through the back window, you can kind of see there's some space through there, as you can see. And then we have a nice, uh, we, uh, it's a nice, a spoiler, yeah, I'm just losing my words here. And it's got a nice, it's got nice lights. Nissan logo, the GTR logo, it's really nice detailed, my favourite one so far. Oh, and I just realised the windshield also has some clear windshield wipers. Then we have the sleekest looking one, we have the Brabus. V63S, yeah. As you can see, you can kind of open it up, the front. Like so, it's really nice detailed, the B logo and the lights, it's really nice. Sadly this one, the door doesn't open, if it did it would be so, so good. And uh, it's got some nice black and red rims. And then as you can see it's got a spare tyre on the back which is also really nice. As you can see, here's the top windshield wiper on the back. And I wonder if we... Oh, and also it has this switch you can connect to a trailer. This is really nice, I like it. I don't know why every time I'm taking it away, I always drift them. Anyways, the Mercedes AMG one, the smoothest one out of all of them. We have the nice Mercedes logo, the nice lights, the nice sleek metal black look. It's really nice, the grills, everything really looks like nice and the doors open up. Like so. It's got a nice suspension as well. The also, if I close it up, the silver and black rims also look really nice. And the mini spoiler on the back also looks really nice as well. The back detailing is amazing. Anyway, the final one, and maybe a lot of people's favourites, <clears throat> the Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. This one is a bit stiff. It's got some, it's got a nice um, detailing on the front, not much though, and the grills look really nice. This one doesn't really have much printing at all to be honest. Wait, on this side yeah, it has the SRT Demon logo, and then on the back it's got a small little spoiler, and then the lights, and the blue windshield. And also the doors open up. <clears throat> I 
I, I like doing that. Oh, it would have been so nice. There you go. Perfect. There we go. So this is a quick look at all of them. So first, I'll do a rate coop. Now the Nissan GTR. Now the Brabus. Now the Mercedes AMG. And guys, if you like this video, I'll make sure to get some more. Because already I got one a few days ago. And I've already uploaded the video, so make sure you check it out. It's Italian Cars. Lamborghinis and Alfa Romeos. And then we have the final car. The Challenger, Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. So I hope you guys like it, subscribe to see my videos, bye guys.